News on NBC6 at 6 starts now. And after a hurricane hits, the water you drink is potentially contaminated. So one city aims to clean it up with technology that could literally make clean water out of thin air. Pipes broken or sewage spills. When a hurricane hits, water contamination is really a big concern. And it affects everybody, right? So one local city is taking advantage of new technology that can harness the power of air to make drinkable water for everybody here in South Florida. Welcome back. When a hurricane crashes onto shore with destructive winds and deadly storm surge, it's a threat to clean water supply and is a major concern. Absolutely. In the city of Miami Gardens, it's getting ahead of the curve here. Hoping to prevent a water crisis by employing technology can actually make drinking water wow. out of air. Mom always said you can't produce something out of thin air. Now you can. Water. The city of Miami Gardens announced a partnership with WaterGen, an Israel-based technology company that came up with a way to make water out of air. First we clean the air, we purify the air with filters and a process. Then it goes through the condensers and all our revolutionary and patented technology. WaterGen has three units, a small one for home use, producing about three gallons of drinking water a day, a medium-sized for schools, hospitals, large businesses, and a large unit providing 1,000 gallons a day, possibly more. Our machine that was supposed to do 450 liters in 24 hours, in four hours basically achieved that role in the last couple of days here. It's been a little humid. It tastes good. Miami Gardens Mayor Oliver Gilbert isn't sure how or where they'll use these units, most likely in an emergency situation, like a boil water advisory or perhaps after a hurricane. So why Miami Gardens? WaterGen says the city attracts manufacturing and technology businesses. They're also the site of Super Bowl 54. They have worked very hard in showcasing new technology and are working with countries to attract businesses here in the city of Miami Gardens. No infrastructure is needed, just power and humidity, which South Florida has plenty of. Home units will be available at the end of the fourth fiscal quarter, and it's technology allowing us not to have to worry about what's in our pipes or water. Lakayim to life and Lamayim to water. WaterGen working with numerous countries around the world, and they expect to be in mass production in the next six months.